Hi everyone, Johnny Mac here, MacMind.io. I wanted to get this short video out. I did figure out how to hide that mouse pointer when we're booting up our web kiosk. So I know a few of you had been asking about this and let's get right into it. So we can see here, we're not the only ones with this problem, okay? This is a bug that's been opened in the Cage project. Remember, Cage is the uh, app that is running our code and locking it down, right? So we run Chromium inside Cage. Now, Cage uses Wayland as its compositor by default, and that's what was posing challenges. It's really difficult to get a hold of things, uh, and that mouse pointer is one of them. So this is a ticket that was opened by Travis G. Hansen, and he reports here, right, he ultimately ended up replacing all the themes with the above mentioned to get it to work. So what he's doing is he's replacing all the cursor themes in the OS with invisible cursors. So the pointer is still there, it's just hidden, you can't see it, right? So let's get into what that looks like. If we follow this along, we have this transparent cursor theme project from John Odin, thank you, John Odin. And he's gonna go ahead and provide cursors for all of the different ways that the cursor can show up on the screen. And these are just gonna be invisible cursors. So when we get into our code now, we're just gonna go ahead and drop this in, okay? And uh, that's right here, transparent cursor. We're gonna put all these cursors here including the cursor theme. And then we're just gonna go ahead when we're building our image, we're gonna find the user share icons directory, right? That's where our cursor themes live at the, in the OS. And we're just gonna replace everything in that direct, all of the themes, okay? Now, we don't know how many there are, but we're just replacing all of them. So no matter which one the OS picks, it's gonna hide the cursor, okay? And so when we go ahead then and see this in action, there's our splash screen, right? And then, Look, no cursor, right? No mouse pointer, and we're gonna go straight into our web kiosk. So this is super exciting. I hope you uh, find this to be valuable for you. But remember, this may not be what you want. Please test this. I don't know what uh, other side effects there might be yet. Um, so I'm gonna be doing that, but I wanted to get this out there. I'm gonna update this project. Please let me know how it's going. Remember, never stop experimenting, challenging assumptions, and seeking the objective truth. I'm Johnny Mac, macmind.io.